Hello everybody, welcome back to another video here. It is me, Jason, with episode 4 of the 2K23 My NBA King series. Let's get into it. Alright, in today's video, we're going to be um, simcasting these last eight games until the playoffs. Uh, we've pretty much, we've clinched a play-in spot, and apparently, I didn't know this, we are the number one seed. So even if we lose out, we're going to be in the play-in minimum. Uh, that, is, that is amazing. I am glad to hear that. So we're going to start with simulating this game against the uh, Minnesota Timberwolves here. Not starting the game off too good. Uh, hoping to make a comeback in the second half, and that is exactly what we did. If you didn't watch last episode, I simulated the other or the four games or the eight games before this. You should definitely go watch it. It was pretty pretty good. Um, we we jump in at most four minutes left. If it's a somewhat close game, I'll jump in. Uh, up five with about three minutes left. We're gonna jump into this one. All right, end of the game here. We have the ball. Let me check some stats. I want to see who has the hot hand. Sabonis, so uh, Fox has made two of his two threes, I guess. Uh, team is shooting terribly right now, but we're winning. For them, it's Carl Anthony Towns. All right, what play are we running here, Coach? What play are we running? Oh, we're playing a we're running a play for Monk. We don't do that very often. It's because I suck at shooting. And and Darren steals it. Yeah, that. And one, yeah, I think, I think we can, <laughs> we were in here for about 30 seconds maybe. Yeah, I think it's safe to say we can simulate the rest of this. Yeah. Well, uh, didn't, we, we didn't need much help on that one. I was in there for 30 seconds. Uh, yeah, it, we just, oh, that was easy. Alright, simulating the next game here. Oh, have we clinched a playoff spot? Not, not a playoff spot. A play-in. Alright, simcast it. We started the game off hot, but then they made a big run at that end of the first. Oh, looks like we're... Oh, I thought we were pulling away a little bit. All right. Down one with two and a half minutes left. Let's get into another game here. And we're into this one, man. Down one, two and a half minutes left. Let me check the stats. Damon lillard has been playing really good. De'Aaron Fox has been playing really good. Holy cow, he's missed two shots. Uh, Keegan Murray, Sabonis had another triple double. So it's an overall real good game. And especially from De'Aaron having 32. Boom, and getting the assist. Easy. Easy. Alright, now we have the lead. Oh, that was easy. Let's go. Boom. Good block! Let's go, Keegan. Keegan is so good at that defense in that situation that we were just in. He just is so good at just getting that block, no fouls. Wow, I absolutely just cooked Damien. Holy cow, and this, this crowd is getting loud. dunk for De'Aaron. He likes those left-handed like, to the side type dunks. And I mean he makes them most of the time, so I don't care what he's doing. I just I just want him to make it. Yeah, but uh, got the W there. I mean, that's what I asked for. Just to get the win. Uh, 28-11 and 11 for Damien. So he did have a really good game, but De'Aaron Fox had 38, so. 28 isn't quite 38. And we're playing Portland again. Can we blow them out this time? Good start. Good second quarter. Bad third quarter. And we blow them out. Yeah, that's a good win on us. Um, Damian Lillard with 34. 
De'Aaron with 30. So Keegan had a really good game too. Um, so bonus almost had a triple double. Uh, just really good overall basketball. One for seven for Barnes is not, not good. I'll have you. I'll let you know that. Um, but everybody else shot really efficiently. Oh, bench is getting about 20 minutes across the whole thing. Um, starters aren't getting as many minutes, especially against against the uh, uh, the whoa. I'm about to say against the Spurs is a team we're not worried about. Should we? No, nah, we're up five. We're good. All right, got the W. Darren Fox had 27 or 24 and seven assists. Herder had himself a real good game. Sabonis had a really efficient 16 and 16 game. It's that's out of character for Sabonis. Normally, he's one of our most efficient players. Darren Fox proceeds to only miss two shots. Love to see it. Uh, now simulating this Pelicans game. This is what I'm scared of. We are a guaranteed playoff um we're guaranteed in the playoffs let's go we're the one seed that's kind of crazy honestly we've clinched a playoff berth i'm waiting for that z to see when we clinched let me see some real quick yeah the simulator difficulty is harder than it normally is so i don't know why we're on a stinking nine game winning 10 game winning streak I mean, I'll take it. I will 100% take it. But it's just kind of weird. Uh, we're literally shooting 50% from the field even. But once I see that Z pop up, I'm resting the starters because we've clinched the number one seed. Holy cow, we are blowing them out. I didn't know this team was that good. Are we going to win our first championship in year one? Keegan Murray with 22, Sabonis with 20, 13, 7, 6 steals from my center on 2 misses. That's more like Sabonis. 3 steals, 6, 19. Everybody playing really good. Terrence Davis getting 7 rebounds off the bench is more than we ask from him. Uh, Luka Doncic. I don't know if we're going to win this game. Yeah, we're not really close. Down 15. Uh, you know, you're not going to win... 12 in a row, I guess. I mean, 11 in a row was still really stinking good. Fox had a good game. Sabonis. It's just the supporting cast didn't really come to play that game. But, I mean, we're the one seed. Let me, let me see. What's the playoff? What's the playoff picture looking like? Looking like the Lakers are the 10th seed. Last team in the play-in. Okay. Oh, Boston's already clinched the top seed. And all of these teams have already clinched a playoff spot. So it's literally just the play-in that's up for grabs. And nobody's clinched the play-in. Okay, that's a bit interesting over there. Um, I, I don't care. I'm resting my guys that last game. I don't want them to get too tired. Ooh, looking like we're winning this one so far. And looks like we're running away with it, and we are. Yes, that's a win for us, baby. It's a bonus with 26, 13, and 7. Really good efficiency. Herder had a really good game. Uh, Fox, did you foul out? No. No! No! That's, oh my gosh. De'Aaron's out for the rest of the year. De'Aaron's out for the rest of the year. I don't expect to win, especially this is the two seed against the one seed, and we're resting our good players, so it's not going to be the greatest show. I mean, we absolutely blew them out in the first quarter. We're losing now, but we absolutely blew them out, and now we're going to lose. But, I mean, I'm happy with that first quarter. Luka Doncic wins the MVP award. This stuff is always messed up. Let me just give it to the person that's going to win it in real life. If I can find them. Keegan Murray. I'm kidding. It's going to be Paulo Boncaro that wins it. So him with his 19, 10, 3, 1, and 1, basically. He's going to win it. What, Russell Westbrook won 6 man of the year on Brooklyn. What? 
Why was he on Brooklyn? Well, whatever. Giannis wins Defense Player of the Year. Brunson wins Most Improved. Joe Mazzulla wins Coach of the Year. Nobody on NBA first team. Nobody on NBA second team. One player on NBA third team, and that was it. Come on, man. Really? We're the one seed in the West, and we have one All-NBA third player. Whatever, whatever. No defensive teams, that's not surprising. Macau Bridges is a top guard position. Um, These are all, all messed up. Like, David Roddy is not going to be there. Let's be honest. He's I would love him to because it's one of my favorite teams, but he's not. All right, let's look at the calendar. I want to see that last game. So we lost by 22. Jokic had a 29-point triple-double. Murray had a 30-point uh, bomb. Bryant, one of my former Lakers, had a really good game. Keegan had a really good game. Lyles had a really, really good game off the bench. Uh, Rashawn uh, played like it was his first game of the year, which it was. Uh, Della Vadova, I mean, hey, those are pretty good stats on the year, Deli. Alright, so we're going to simulate the play in here. Um, simulate through that game. So the Phoenix Suns are in. So we're either playing Portland or Golden State. Oh my gosh. I don't want to play either of them. Can I just opt out of the playoffs? Uh, oh my goodness. We're playing Golden State. That sucks. <sighs> Bro. We're playing Golden State. I personally think this is going to be an upset. De'Aaron, we need you. We need you to get back. So, what? when is it said to be his day that he gets back? April 21st? What day is it today? April 16th. So, it'll be two games. It'll be game two, or game three by the time he gets back. What's our coach's staff? Or what's our uh, trainer? I think that... Our trainer sucks. We're getting rid of him. Give us... Sean Lee, Nicholas Foster, uh, David Clark. Sean Lee has the coolest name, in my opinion. Alright, so we're gonna, we're gonna sign him as one of you candidates. Kuba Gooding is kind of cheating, honestly. Mike Brown, good coach. I know the playoffs is not the time to be firing, firing and hiring people, but... We needed to. Sean Lee should help De'Aaron get back faster. Hmm. Played 13 minutes against Golden State, and we still beat them. So we beat them without Golden State. Okay, that's promising. Okay, well, that's the end of this video, guys. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy, please make sure to like, subscribe, turn on the notification bell so you'll never miss any episodes of this series or any other series I do. I really appreciate it. Thank you for watching this video. Till next time. Peace.